What's good, y'all? I'm Scott. In our last video, I showed you how to get rid of buffer bloat so that you have a better online gaming experience. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use the new Microsoft Edge app directly on Xbox to test your buffer bloat on Xbox and see if you have any buffer bloat there and if you need to fix it. So go ahead and install the latest version of the Microsoft Edge app on your Xbox and then head over to www.waveform.com slash tools slash buffer bloat and then run a buffer bloat test. Now this of course takes a couple of minutes and your ultimate goal is to end up with that A or even better yet, an A plus directly on the Xbox. Now, currently I am using an Ultimate Dream Machine Pro. That's right, I've upgraded and it has been really nice. I've been running lots of tests over the past few weeks and it's been, it's been pretty fun. I'm also still using my NetDuma R2. Man, I love that geo filter. It makes a huge difference when it comes to online games. And so I've hooked them both together so that I can keep my latency down, get rid of my buffer bloat and still have a geo filter so I can see where the servers are, see if they're having any trouble for the day, see the location of players that I play on some of my favorite games, which is stuff that I really, really like. So as this test continues here on my Xbox, you can see that I've got everything nice and smooth. I do not have any download or any upload buffer bloat. Now, this has taken a while to figure out exactly how to get here. So in an upcoming video, I'll show you how I've used my Ultimate Dream Machine and my NetDuma R2 together to get this result. All right, everybody, if you liked it, you know what to do. Until the next time, as always, Take it easy.